The words haunt us today as they have haunted the human imagination for thousands of years. Take your son, your only son, Isaac, whom you love, and go to the land of Moriah and offer him there as a burnt offering upon one of the mountains which I shall tell you. Genesis 22, 1. The Akedah, the binding of Isaac, though it is only some 20, 22 verses, is in the Jewish tradition the most commented on incident in the entire Bible. It's impossible for modern man to explain that story. It's impossible to deal with this. I can see this historically, but I can't feel it personally. It's too horrible. One of the strange things is, although Isaac is the one who is going to be sacrificed, the focus is really on Abraham. Because the truth is, we feel it is harder in this case to be the sacrificer than to be the victim. Isaac is a figure of simple, almost pathetic trust. And Abraham is a tormented father who is torn between his love for his son and his duty to a God who has given him a terrible command. Isaac carries the wood to the place of sacrifice, while Abraham carries the fire and the knife. Isaac then asks his father one of the most heart-rending questions in the entire Bible. He said, Behold the fire and the wood, but where is the lamb for a burnt offering? And Abraham said, God will provide the lamb for a burnt offering, my son. So they went both of them together. Genesis 22, 8. Abraham builds an altar and places his son Isaac on top of it. Then Abraham put forth his hand and took the knife to slay his son. But the angel of the Lord called to him from heaven and said, Abraham, Abraham. And he said, Here am I. He said, Do not lay your hand on the lad or do anything to him. For now I know that you fear God, seeing you have not withheld your son, your only son, from me. Genesis 22, 12. never know what happened after that terrifying moment. Did Abraham and Isaac weep? Did father and son embrace through their tears? We know only that Isaac was spared. And Abraham lifted up his eyes and looked. And behold, behind him was a ram caught in a thicket by his horns. And Abraham went and took the ram and offered it up as a burnt offering instead of his son. Genesis 22, 13. Perhaps no story in the Bible has inspired as great an outpouring of speculation as the binding of Isaac. 